We're up here at Eagle Mountain, which is outside of Palm Desert. And uh, this is where the steel came from that built all the tanks in World War II. This is the main depot. It's closed down now. All of these structures that you see here were actually inside of a mountain. They got mined. The mountain went away. The concrete tunnels and, and structure actually stayed here. This is actually a ramp that we used in a Subaru shoot where I drove a rally car up here, it was maybe 60 miles an hour jumped off of this natural piece of concrete that used to be inside of a mountain here at the steel mill. But if you come look at the landing, I'm jumping up here. It's at 12 and a half degrees. I remember that you had to go exactly, I think it was 62 miles an hour in order to land over there, like 90 feet away. I mean, you think about it, it feels, looking at this, it seems stupid, <laughs> frankly. It just seems dumb, but it's, it's really calculated. All stunt guys, I think, that have like a long career are calculated guys they they know what variables can go wrong they know about how suspension compresses they know which parts break variables that you, you wouldn't guess would go wrong they've anticipated those but they're calculated because right here what you do when you do a stunt like this is you don't just go ah seems like 62 and a half miles an hour an engineer taps it all in and says it's this angle uh, it's this car it's this weight distribution this weight that distance and tells you exactly where it's going to land and where to put the landing ramp so it's not all guts to do that kind of stunt stuff. A lot of it is nerdy. And then, at the last minute, it's guts. <laughs>